Hi guys. So I'm making a video versus a live because Facebook's going crazy right now. So I had told you I was gonna come with the taco bake. So I just got everything ready and I'm making a video and I'm gonna attach that to my page. But I will also put the recipe in the comments and a picture of the end result. Okay, so what we have here is just a regular casserole. I'm making a half of what normally gets made because I made half earlier. So you'll have a bigger casserole dish. My oven is at 350 and it cooks for about 30 minutes. So in here I have the sour cream. I'm not gonna give you measurements because it'll be a little different than what you do. So I have my sour cream. I'm gonna add green chilies. I brought some from AJ's but you're gonna wanna buy them and check the back and make sure they don't have any hidden sugars and low carbs, okay? Also to that, it calls for tomatoes. I don't have any tomatoes, so I am compensating and using um, a paste salsa that's very low in sugar. And so I check the back of that to make sure. So that's gonna go in there. And then I have homemade taco seasoning. That's gonna go in there like that and some cheese. Now with cheese, I always recommend, like I always tell you guys, to um, shred your own. I bought mine, I bring it from AJ's, and it is already shredded, which means it has a potato starch on it, which um, helps it from sticking, but it also gives you some carbs, okay? So, make sure you shred your own. I did get a really nice shredder, I'm just gonna mix I want to make sure you guys can see this. There we go. I'm mixing all that sour cream and all the ingredients that I just talked about. This recipe is so easy and looks delicious. I'm going to take a bite before we get done here. Um, so we're just mixing it. It almost is like a really looks like a really good dip is what it reminded me of while I was making it earlier. Okay, so we mixed all that up. Now, we have chicken, and I just did bite-sized pieces of chicken um, that I already was cooked, and we're going to put that in the bottom of our casserole dish. So, yeah, I'm not sure what's wrong with the live feature, but um, I told you I would do this, so we're doing it. We just find ways around Mark Zuckerberg. That's my goal. <laughs> All right, so we layered the bottom with the chicken. We're going to put the sour cream and all the other ingredients on top of this. If I can keep it from falling out of my hand. My thumb has been giving me issues lately. Just the wear and tear of the waitress life, you know? So sometimes grabbing things doesn't always work. <laughs> The joys of overworking a, a limb. So you just layer it like so. Again, it looks like a yummy dip. And then we're gonna put a little more cheese on top. Let's see, make sure you guys can see it. Like that. Just give it a nice layer of cheese on top, a little bit more. There we go. And then I have olives, black olives on top. Probably a little more than I needed but it was the bottom of the container, so we're gonna use them all. And then some chives. We'll put those on top like so. I'm gonna take a few of these olives out and we'll use that on the other one. Okay, and that's it. Looks like that, doesn't that look good? We're gonna bake that on 350 for 30 minutes. All right, let's put that in the oven and I'll grab the other one. Now, that's what it looks like. Looks good, huh? All right. Let's, actually I can use this spoon right here. And let's look at it, okay? Ooh, it's gonna be hot. Let me get to a piece of chicken. There's lots of cheese on it. So the picture that I saw this on Pinterest, it was over um, like a cauliflower rice, 
but I'm not gonna do that. You could put it over a bed of lettuce. We're just gonna eat it just plain like this. You could put a salad on the side. Mm. Mm. Wow. That is delicious. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. So good. Definitely delicious. So that's it. It's that easy. Like I said, this is just a video, not a live. So the recipe and the picture will be in the comments. And um, that's it. I hope you guys enjoy it. Tomorrow, hopefully I'll be live tomorrow with the sausage um, bake that we talked about. It's a sausage casserole. I gave you guys a option of the two. And they both got a lot of um, votes. So I'm going to just do both. That makes it easier. Mm, love and appreciate you. Bye.